Hey, what's up Yoon fam? It is I, Mark Yoon, and today I'm bringing you another hopefully exciting video. So what I got for you today is actually another collaboration between King of Fighters All-Star, which is the mobile version of King of Fighters. It's actually a really good game. There's actually a lot of uh, input involved into it, and I would recommend if you play any mobile games at all to check this one out. But they've done a lot of collaborations, as does a lot of these licensed mobile games, and uh, this one's particularly more exciting for me because they are actually doing on December 22nd, uh, which, by the way, if you do download it, start logging in now because they have like uh, free crystals for summoning, like I think like 500 every day and then like 1,000 on the seventh day uh, just before the collaboration, so you'll have ample opportunity to get the new characters. They are doing a collaboration with Soul Calibur 6. Yes, you heard me correctly, Soul Calibur 6. Um, this actually is really good because there's a lot of reasons why Soul Calibur would allow cross promotion with this to put eyes on its next project. Uh, this is for Soul Calibur 6, but as you know, there's been no uh, updates on Soul Calibur 6 since Huang Sung Young came out like two Christmases ago. So this is definitely like another peek into the future of the franchise going forward. Yet, I want to talk about just this collaboration today, so let's just jump right into it. So this collaboration is uh, not something new for King of Fighters All-Star. Um, I'll be showing some gameplay from my personal uh, account. And as you'll see, they actually did a Tekken one not that long ago. And I was lucky enough to pull uh, Devil Jin, which is probably the number one character that I use the most. I use like him, uh, like Summer, Mai, Shiranui, and uh, hopefully the third character that I use, I'll actually replace with uh, one of the Soul Calibur characters. But there is a trailer, so before I go into the details, let me show you the trailer and then we'll come right back. I hope you're ready. Shall be your grave. I'll fight you. See what you like. Painful. I'm gonna go all out. All right, so that was the trailer. Uh, I think the trailer was actually pretty excellent. Shows off a lot. They actually do a lot of their iconic moves and the characters that you saw were in there. So we're going to show them on the screen right now. The, sh the characters are as follows. It is Cassandra and then uh, an armored version of Cassandra made into armor. Uh, Ivy and then another version of Ivy, uh, which you can actually get, I think, in an event right now before the, the collaboration even goes live. There is Taki and Sung Mina. So those are the characters that are actually summonable. Uh, I don't know why it's all the females. Like they do usually use um, some of the males with these collaborations. I don't know why they did with Soul Calibur, but again, that's like up to Project Soul and King of Fighters, like the dev, uh, whoever. <laughs> it's actually Netmarble, which is a Korean company, but whatever they decided on allowing the licenses to, that's who they went to. So. I'm not really complaining. I'm going to try to go for uh, Ivy or Sungmina uh, personally, but I would love to get all of them in the collaboration if I possibly could. They do have some cool moves, and I will be showing you an example of the gameplay. <laughs> Just so you know, it's not like a card 
button push or whatever, there actually is a controller on screen. So you are actually doing moves and there is a, it's like a side scroll beat em up, but there's moves that you do for inputs. And then there's also, uh, you collect special cards to get like ultimate moves and special attacks and stuff like that. And those are one tap, one tap clicks, but overall the game is pretty fun. Um, this collaboration has me excited though, just because of the fact that it's more Soul Calibur in our lives and who doesn't love that, <laughs> but I don't know. There's a, a lot going on with this collaboration and I love seeing this kind of stuff. I'm looking forward to it. It should be Tuesday. Uh, well, tomorrow's Tuesday, maybe possibly Wednesday, Tuesday night, Wednesday. I don't know. It's the 22nd of December. Um, so this is going live. Let me look at the date. <laughs> this is actually going live on the 19th. So... Uh, it'll be three days from today, which is Thursday. So anyway, uh, with that being said, guys, um, a lot of these things like that they do are fun for cross promotion. And why this is important to me personally is because there's been a lot of hints coming forward about Soul Calibur 7. And there's also been a lot of evidence that people like uh, have looked at and stuff. And I've talked about on my channel, but them collaborating like this and allowing their characters to be in a game like this is kind of a nod from Project Soul to be like, hey, don't forget me, right? So it's like, it's been two years since an update, but this is kind of their little nod of saying like, hey, there's still stuff coming. So uh, I don't know if that means that we're not gonna get a trailer. Like, well, definitely not gonna get a trailer in 2022. Like we've been saying forever, that, like we're probably gonna get the trailer in 2023. It's probably gonna release late 2023, if not 2024 in the beginning. So. I don't know. I'm just looking forward to it. Um, this is going to be more chances to jump back in and show people that like Soul Calibur is still a thing. Hopefully it helps bolster some of the online play for Soul Calibur 6 for a little bit. Um, give it a little boost just to show that there's like more engagement because I know the player base isn't very high right now, um, especially on PC and Xbox. Like there is some small community on X on PlayStation, but since like they haven't like done tournaments in a while, um, the average player base is pretty low. So I don't know. Uh, what are your thoughts on this collaboration? Are you excited about this collaboration at all? Like, are you going to go summon for any of these characters? I know gotchas are kind of like an iffy thing because a lot of people don't like summoning for things. Um, I'm free to play, so I don't spend money in these games. So I just do it like in the morning time before work if I want to have some fun. And uh, I don't know. That's it. So any no thoughts are always welcome in the comment section down below. I will do a community poll uh, on asking who you're going to summon for the most. And so be sure to go over and go to the community tab and vote on that and tell me your thoughts in the comment section of that. And uh, anywhere else that comments are allowed, <laughs> we can join me over in Discord. We can bring the conversation over there. It's a great community over there. It's a lot of fun. We talk about everything, not just like Soul Calibur and fighting games. So I love to see you over there. Uh, the link is in the description box down below for that. And as I always say, guys, I'm going to bring this video to a close. I love it. Thank you. And thank you.